Hello everyone. So today we will see uh, how to position images and tables in your uh, latex doc document um, in Overly. So uh, it's really is uh, a common practice that uh, when you are using some other text editors that you insert some images and table and you want to position them uh, into a particular particular location in your text or you want to align them uh, left right or top bottom. So it, it is also we can also do the same in the, uh, you can say LaTeX, um, like the example given here. Um, this is a picture that is uh, inserted in the text and you can see uh, that it is uh, by default, it is uh, uh, aligned uh, to the right of the text. Um, then uh, the, when you talk about basic positioning, um, uh, you can uh, uh, use the package, use package export adjust box. Uh, and when you do that, you get the option of, uh, uh, you can say, uh, aligning the picture according to your will, uh, which is left, right, uh, and uh, there are many others as well. Um, so that's left, right, center, outer, inner. So these are the, uh, you can see options you can uh, explore. So let's uh, try this. I am using this package, adjust box. And I have an image already inserted here, here. So let's uh, just, I will just copy this one so that uh, other thing will be same. Right. And now so you can see it, 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 it has an eye to the right of the uh, you can see text and uh, the whole impact uh, page has been aligned to the right of the text according to this. So this is how it works. Uh, similarly, if I go to center, you can see it has it is now centrally aligned. Um, so uh, it, it, that's how it, 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 it is aligned in your text. The figure environment uh, uh, has also, uh, you can say, some uh, positioning uh, parameters, uh, and you can uh, see that there are these are the position parameters. Uh, you define H, uh, you place H when you um, when the position is approximate, T when the uh, you want to place it at the top of the page, P at the bottom of the page, and and uh, put. Uh, P for special page and so on. So uh, let's try some of them. I used H before, but let's do V. So, so it, it, you can see it, it has gone to the bit bottom. Similarly, I try this. So, has come to this page now. So, uh, you can uh, uh, keep on trying these different parameters. Um, so, capital H for the precise location. Let's see if I uh, just put this here. So it is giving me an unknown float. Uh, I don't know why, but it should not be the problem. I 
I guess uh, there is some problem with H uh, here, capital H. So you can also try the combination is for example, if you uh, write HT later, we'll try to position the figure here. Um, but if uh, not possible, uh, then the figure will appear at the top of the uh, page. So, so that's how it works. So it, it is always approximate. And then you can also include multiple figures, uh, images in one, uh, you can see figure. Uh, here is an example. So let's just try this example. So basically it is a concept of, you have sub figures in a, in a big figure. So this is figure and then these are sub figures. So rest of the mechanism is same. Uh, we will just copy paste it so that we can save time. So these are the figures I will just, because uh, I have one figure, so I will. But I guess there we need to include some environment for that, your package for that. Ah, in the use package sub caption. So you can see these are the two figures that, that has been incorporated. Actually, it is a one figure. And we have, uh, we can, uh, you can say, uh, subdivide the space in, and uh, allocate it to two separate figures. Uh, if we have multiple figures and we have great number of figures and we want to include that in uh, one uh, big chunk, so we can do this in this way as well, um, including multiple figures in a single figure, or you can say, but, uh, you can merge uh, multiple figures into one figure so uh, so this is a figure option can do the this for you um, then you can also wrap around the figure i so this one here is for this you you will get the, this output uh, in your text and this is already uh, i have demonstrated it here and uh, for this you just have to do the uh, package wrap fig uh, and uh, just other, other all other things are the same. Um, here is the uh, you can say letter code for this. Um, you use a wrap fig instead of fig, and just the rest of the things are same. So that is how we can wrap the figure in the text. Um, you and similarly uh, you uh, go for the positioning of the. Uh, table uh, we will, which we will discuss later on. Uh, so just uh, for now, we will uh, we are done here and just practice it at home. Thank you.